think we're ready. Good morning, campers. All right, so what's the best way out of here now? They've turned some stuff around since last time. It used to be the exit was over here. Now they've completely reversed. 200 feet reversed. ahead, turn right on ramp to I-64 can, West. Can you wait till I'm done with the parking lot? Now they've completely reversed the fuel island. So I think the exit's technically on the other side. Also, there's a lot of illegally parked trucks on on this entrance. I, I bet you can't even get into the Catskill right now. There's just too many trucks over there. Which would suck, because I've used this Catskill before. We've got a lot of customers up here. I think there's one across the street in the Petro as well, though. So yeah. We're one of the last folks to uh, wander out of here this morning. I'm okay with that. It hasn't gotten super Point busy. One mile ahead. Uh, Turn around. Let's stop here and see what Prime's doing. I'm not getting fuel. I'm just trying to exit. And you're getting fuel. Alright, that's what I thought.
we're going to be driving through West Virginia. There is no way on earth to maximize your fuel economy going through West Virginia. So I just want to get through it as fast as possible. So full speed, 62 miles per hour. And uh, we'll get to the other side of West Virginia soon enough. Since we just, uh, what was that? Oh, that was my, uh, that was the pressure equalizing in the bottle of Gatorade on my dashboard. Um, <laughs> pop. Pop, 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 pop. Um, so since we are, we did just fuel, and the week rolled over while I was at home. So I have reset my fuel economy meter back to zero miles traveled, zero gallons burned, uh, though we're currently at 2.8 miles traveled and 0.9 miles burned, uh, that, or 0.9 gallons burned, um, mostly because that was uh, engine warm up. It was very, very cold last night. It was like four degrees here that, uh, from the low. So we, so we had to warm up the engine and uh, climb this hill out of there. So our fuel economy is going to start off real bad. So it should be all uphill from there, right? 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 Oh, I hope so. I have I have averaged as low as five miles per gallon across the state of West Virginia. It's, it's why I have my rules. You do not enter West Virginia with less than three quarters of a tank of fuel. Or at least you don't enter the West Virginia Turnpike with less than that. There's there's a couple of TA uh, of, there's a couple of truck stops in Western West Virginia that we can use to fuel up, but last last resort sorts of things. Our goal for today is Mount Sterling, Kentucky. It's only about a six hour drive away. So uh, should be there like 3:30 p.m. Four o'clock. 330 miles. Sorry. So yeah. 34 o'clock still looks good for that. Probably closer to 4 because I'm guessing I'll have to stop and use the restroom more than once. Uh, we're approaching 75 mile an hour. Let's get on the engine brakes. my 
theory anyway, because I know that I know they think that the multiplayer mod is really cool. I, th I think they're super happy that people that people multiplayer the game. So I do believe they designed stuff with that in mind, even though they don't officially support it. Brake lights. Uh oh. What you guys doing? Just, just the usual NASCAR thing? Alright. I think we're catching up with whatever cluster is happening in front of us, though. That's not great. We're only six miles from the Interstate 64-81 split, so... We'll just stay behind this... This cluster truck. Oh, it was you. Okay, that's what it was. It was a cop. <laughs> wow. Go Virginia State Trooper. Making everybody slow down. Here. 
may feel kind of guilty. Like, am I wasting time by being so cautious through the toll plazas? It's like people, people get mad at me at toll plazas because I slow down going into them. I actually drop to the posted speed on there. I, we, I, even still, as slow as I went, slower than anybody else there, I still wasn't doing five miles per hour. We were doing like seven or eight through the toll, through the toll booth. And people were flying past us. So, I don't know. I feel like it's the responsible thing to do to slow down a bunch. Like the speed limit is 35. Drop to 35 and then just engine brake down to wherever the toll booth speed is. Nice and gradual. Everyone behind you knows what to expect. You're not going to slam on the brake suddenly. I feel like that's safer, but that's just me. That's apparently just me. Alright. Cruise control back on. I think I can see our parking spot from here. Or at least our attempted parking spot. It's only 4 p.m. I really find it hard to believe we're not going to get a parking spot at a major truck stop at 4 p.m. But we, we do have two alternates, even if, you know, worst comes to worst, we have two alternates. But I don't think we're going to need them. I think we're going to snag ourselves a spot right here at the pilot in Mount Sterling, Kentucky. This is a truck stop I've been to before. We have a customer at this exit, a, uh, a Nestle warehouse that we have picked up cargo at before. Uh, multiple times, actually. They like me here. They really, they, uh, the Nestle warehouse folks like me because I'm exit friendly. And then turn left on US 60 West. Also, I was the only person that was able to help them in a couple of situations. When I, when I was there, they had like two different prime trailers where the door sensors were bad. And I taught their yard person how to override the sensor, so they liked me a lot there. <laughs> so, bonus points, bonus points for me. Oh, the exercise is taking the spot I wanted. <laughs> ourselves 
right next to one of the Wi-Fi routers. <laughs> and I've got a day off, so we're gonna pay for it. We're gonna pay for a little bit of Wi-Fi, I think. Or burn some points on it. And uh, see if I can't do some uh, some video game stuff while we're here. Anyway, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Late, late, late tomorrow night. Uh, so that might actually just be part of the next day's video. I don't know. See how we did. About perfect. And, uh, yeah. Nice and close. <laughs> good to know as we can't hit this pole unless our tandems are full forward. That's good to know. Did I just step in poop? Did I really just step in poop? Nope. Nope. Cool. My name is Elio Dare, Azarangel17 on Twitch, Xbox Live, and Steam. Drop in, say hi. Let me know if you enjoy the videos by clicking like or subscribe, and of course, come say hi on the Twitters at Elio Dare. No apostrophe in the username, but of course you can search with the apostrophe. I still pop up. Branding. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching and have a great day.